Hello everybody, my name's Peter and welcome to my channel. I just thought I'd like to give a little introduction into myself, my background and um, why I got interested in RC. So I was first introduced into model making through my dad. Um, he used to make plastic model kits and um, that kind of inspired me to take up the hobby as well. Um, we used to have trips to the local model shops where we'd look around for plastic model kits to buy um, and make. Um, <clears throat> also in the model shops there was a, a, a large selection of RC cars, planes and aeroplanes which really used to fascinate me. I just liked the idea of being able to like build something that was kind of realistically scale and control it without um, having to push it with your hand or having a wire attached to it. So I got really fascinated by that and I, I was, I was loved to have had one, although then, you know, as a small boy, it was kind of out of, out of reach for me and it was out of reach for my parents really. Um, and then I would, I would look, look longingly at all the, all the cars and all the different aeroplanes and, and things. Anything I'll see, I would just be fascinated by. So, my journey started in RC um, kind of one day when I was walking through BT's looking for plastic model kits with my dad and I just happened to walk past a video monitor and on the video, there were, around the monitor there was a large crowd and playing on the monitor was a, a Tamiya promo of the Boogie Rough Rider and <clears throat> on top of the monitor there was actual model car of the, you know, the actual Boogie Rough Rider model car and I saw this and I was totally blown away with it. I'd never ever seen anything like this in my entire life, you know. Um, <clears throat> before I, th I thought, you know, model cars and stuff were just IC, nitro and and were kind of roughly, roughly scale. Um, when I saw this, I was just totally blown away by it. The suspension, the shock absorbers were so realistic and I, I just couldn't get away. I just couldn't stop thinking about it all the time. And I, I just so longed to have, have a car like that. It was just unreal as a small boy. So it, it was this car that has become so special to me, um, the Boogie Rough Rider, um, that inspired me and started my journey into RC. And so, I, I never actually owned one as a child, um, funnily enough. Um, this one is obviously, I, I, bought, I bought actually off uh, an internet um, site. Uh, it was already ready made and um, it was kind of a, um, a passion for a, a long, long, long dream um, fulfilled really to actually own uh, a Boogie Rough Rider. This now just sits kind of on my desk and and it's just nice to look at when you know some days are difficult at work um, I kind of just look at it and it kind of makes me happy really. So this Boogie Rough Rider was the start of my journey into RC and I actually I actually bought off a, off a, off a friend at school um, a Mardave stock car and it, it was really really tatty and it, it didn't run very well and it was quite in need of some modernization um, so I kind of I bought it because I I was really really wanted a, a car you know a radio controlled car it didn't have no radio gear and it was just about affordable to me because I didn't have that much money to spend and it was a bit of a wreck. Um, so I bought this car and for Christmas my dad bought me a radio set and um, we ended up, I ended up joining a, the local model stock car club 
in my area and that's where kind of my journey kind of progressed for quite a few years so I, I wasn't very good for a few years and then I kind of put my put my determination into it for one year and then it kind of inspired it I seemed to get it all together and uh, I had you know reasonable success with that so Tammy Cars took a kind of a back line after that it was car I was racing racing uh, model stock cars week in week out all up and down the country and um, I had no time for anything else really and I, I loved it I really did love it it was such a a nice hobby to be in you know, I enjoyed racing my model cars meeting people up and down the country and it was such a it was I met some lovely people and I had some really, really good times, some time, you know, some, some ha really, really happy memories. And I did that for a few years. After that, kind of, kind of drifted away from that, time, life kind of got in the way. And, and then after a few years, after a break from not being involved with RC, I, um, I started flying model aeroplanes. And I did that for a while, and I've still got some RC model aeroplanes, and um, that was challenging. And so I would like to, on my channel, um, be able to show you some of my RC aeroplane builds as well, um, given the opportunity. So that's just a quick roundup of uh, my background and my interest in RC. I hope you enjoy. Um, watching my videos when I am able to put them up. Um, so that's it for now. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, goodbye.